Hello, Swami Gang Gang. We're continuing our adventure today in Baldur's Gate 3. So let's go over what happened. Last episode, Carlax said, Soldier, this ain't a drill. Knock the others out because it's going down tonight. But like clockwork, a star you need to talk to me as well. At this point, he's doing this on purpose. This is his third time cock blocking me. This, it's not fair. This time, he tried to use this vampire charm to persuade me to do the right thing by mind controlling every powerful thinking creature so we could have a little cold of our own. That's, that's pretty much what I got. Oh, and no goblins, of course. They don't count in Astarian's eyes. He does not think they're thinking creatures. Now, I'm not gonna say I like goblins, but I think they're thinking creatures. Come on, man. I then asked him if he had a plan for this taking over the world with mind flayer tap holes. And he said that he's not a details person, but turning up and causing chaos has worked for us so far. So no, he has no plan. But how dare I doubt him? Sorry, I'm I'm getting confused of which game I'm playing here. I swear, I've I've heard something similar like this before. Anywho, I ended up knocking everybody out, making sure they were asleep, because me and Carlick are now up. And Tav was finally, finally able to give Carlick the night she deserves. I'm not gonna lie, this this interaction was cute steamy and and very passionate i had to blur the part everybody really wants to see but the fact that both carlac and i were singing in the morning should tell you everything you need to know about that interaction it was amazing carlac and tav started to play this little game called who was gonna say it first and we lost of course because life is short and it is a good day to be alive. And I said it with my chest, God damn it! Cause I don't play, I stand on business. Oh, and Carlac's reaction was priceless. I'm not gonna lie, that is that is probably my same reaction if I was in her shoes. Just, just saying. So I think it's safe to say that Tav and Carlac are officially together, finally. So hopefully everyone can just dial it back on the thirst for Tav or Carlac or both. Just dial it back, okay? Tav and Carlac are happy in a in a happy relationship. We don't need this thirst anymore. We're we're good. <laughs> and and that's pretty much it. You're all caught up now. Hi, Future Swami here. I'm aware about patch six. Don't worry, I'm currently playing on that as we speak. But this gameplay is played on patch 5. We won't get to patch 6 until we get into act 3. So it's it's going to be a while. But we on patch 5. This is good too. But Laurie and Sirius just keep dropping bangers with these patches. And I just, I can't keep up. I'm not used to this type of love and attention. First cultists nearly murder us. And now we have a traitor on the inside. Used to. Can't we trust anyone? Well, that's a good question. But, you know, us blue tiefling bars got to stick together. You can trust me. I know. You've been there for us every step of the way. It's just all a bit much sometimes, you know? I know. Hey, after all this is over, we're gonna drop the biggest banger in Baldur's Gate. Hello, Jahira! Traitors among us. A child taken. And still I can only feel relief. If they had taken Isabel too. I, I know. I, I watched it happen three different times. Two of those times, Isabel looked like she just wanted to go. We had to hold her down. Honesty will serve you better than charity. Oh, I'm being fucking honest. I blundered into their trap, and it cost us. You have the honor of making up for my mistake. I trust that you will. I, I got you, Jahira. I got you. Hey, there's something I want to ask you. Then speak. Well, I had to look up who you were, but Taz heard your name before. Where? Ugh, some crusty ballad monger, I expect. They have me slaying gods, or laying with them, depending on the bard. Hmm, interesting. Because I've heard it was both. Is that true? You'll have to sing that one for me when all of this is done. Oh, I'll come up with something, don't worry. In any case, it was a lifetime ago by now. And for all our victories, we remain on the back foot. We fight, we die, and we just hope that when our time comes, there is someone else to take our place. Stirring words. 
Is that how you inspire your Harpers? Because you've inspired me, Jihira. I barely know you, and I kind of just glanced over your synopsis and just saw that you're in both one and two, but you're a leader. <laughs> no need of that. Every Harper is a bard unto themselves, I'm afraid. Help me root out this cult, and they can spin stories about you for a change. Cool. There'll be features on my album that I'm dropping. It's gonna be called Tav. Yep, just my name alone. I'm gonna be famous as Beyonce, Any Madonna, and Prince combined. Ooh, I do like that. Prince. Yeah, that's that's the route I'm going. Oh, that's where I was hearing the sing. I was hearing singing the last time I talked to Isabel. I was like, what is that? It's this guy here. If you have an alternative in mind, please do post it. Patience. We may know ways to reverse that. We don't even know if you'll ever recover. But we do know that anyone who goes charging into those shadows is dead. Can y'all stop talking? I was trying to listen to him sing. Flame Color. That's your name, isn't it? Art Color? I'm Fistula. Nathaniel and me are climb, climb, climbing up a tree. We, we need you, sir. One of our own's been taken, a Grand Duke. You might know something that could help us bring him back. We found him out in the shadows, just wandering. Nothing survives out there for long. Don't know how he made it or where he came from. This is no physical ailment. It is a spiritual malaise. The man's mind has been gripped by the shadow fell, yet it has not broken. You know, the bard of me wants to say, I've never heard that tune. Maybe it's original composition. No, I, I need to be serious here. I have heard the name of Thaniel before from a friend of mine named Halzen. Really? Mm-hmm. Could you bring him here? I could try. You'd be glad of the help, wouldn't you, sir? Okay, now we got that out of the way. I've I've never heard that tune. Maybe it's original composition. Maybe he was a musician. A musician, you say? Then I will search his body for any indication of preferred instrument. You notice the distinctive calluses on the man's hands. Hmm. The kind only developed from decades of playing the lute. It takes one to know one. Hey, let me let me have a look at him. Maybe I can maybe I can get something from him. Oh, if you know how to get through to him. Don't hesitate. All right, time to be an unlicensed doctor here. Hello, I'm Dr. Taff. I'm here to observe your present condition. How are you feeling? I got a roll for that, of course. They're like, mm, we, we don't buy this. And they are absolutely correct. I am not a licensed doctor. I rolled a nine on that. Yeah, I'm going to use some inspiration. I'm going to try that again. Um, Shadowheart, can you give me some guidance here? This is my nurse, Shadowheart. She's going to help me out. Okay, okay. We both are going to observe the patient here. We got this. The patient is physically well, but psychologically detached. Hmm. Dissociated from himself. I feel like I could have told you that. He's been in the shadow. Oh, fell. thank you, Nurse Shadowheart. All memories will have been stripped away. We need to remind him who he is. Some personal effects, maybe? Well said, Nurse Shadowheart. Well said. Um... I mean, I have a loot. I can I, Does it have to be his loot or? Um, ma'am, did you already check for personal effects? This was in his pocket. He doesn't seem to have any reaction to it now, but he held on to it for a hundred years oh, anyway. Oh, how old is this man? Um, sir, do you know where you are? If he does, he isn't saying. I wasn't asking you. Okay, I think this is serious. We some parchment now. Thing. Thanks, Nurse Shadowheart. I'll go ahead and take a look at that. But we do need to get the specialist. Hal's in here. I think he's going to help us. But before we do that, we will read what this says. Yeah, I just need everybody to shut up while I'm reading here. I should be the only one talking. Okay. Assignee. Art color. Rank. Flame. Objective. To obtain information about current activities in Moonrise Towers and its environs, headed by Cethric Thorm of the region's ancestral Thorm family. Orders, take lodging in the Last Light Inn and begin investigation in the local House of Healing 
Reports indicate corruption, but no corroborating has yet been attained. No, the region's Thorn family are long-standing devotees of Salune, but rumors indicate a Sharian enclave might be gaining momentum. Investigate and report. Sign, Grand Duke Eltan. I, I have a question here. I just, I just thought about this when I was reading. So if Art Kulag has been like this for a hundred years, is what they said. Why the fuck would he know about where Will's dad's at? He doesn't know his dad is the Grand Duke. He doesn't know who he is. How would he know? How would he know where he is? That's just so dumb. For all we know, he's still in a comatose state, and I guess he's somewhat responsive because if someone's trying to talk to him, he starts singing. It's the same song, but he starts singing. So is he aware of what's going on? And he just can't say anything. Like I'm, I'm, I'm confused. We should probably check in on Damon to see how he is mentally. Take oh, Carla. That's right, you weren't with me. Okay, last time we saw Demon. We saw the strange ox over there. Remember the strange ox? Yeah, turns out he's not an ox. He's just a big blob thing that murders people. Yeah, we killed it. <gasps> the blob's gone. Where did the blob go? Nowhere safe from this damned absolute. Nor from shape-shifting cow blob things. Well, you made short enough work of that one. You're welcome. Glad you handled it before it handled me. Yeah, we still need you alive. If you need something sharp, I have a few things left. Cool. Hey, earlier you mentioned you could work interesting materials. What did you mean? I could sense some. Smell it almost. Somewhere in the area. Underground, maybe. Out there in the shadows. If you find it, bring it to me. I'll make something incredible. Oh. It's a weapon for me. No. I thought I thought you were gonna like make something for Carlac here so she save her engine, but no, I I'm good. I think this is a good time to explore to see what's out there. I don't wanna miss I don't wanna miss anything. This game is so fun. I wanna I wanna keep playing and I feel like there's a certain things that you have to go out there and find to do. And that's exactly what we're going to do. And thanks to us being blessed by Salune, we can just explore without torches. That dead bird's been corrupted by the shadows. Would be wise to leave it alone. Okay, I will not touch the dead bird. Anything over here? Mm. No. Oh, there's a trunk. There's nothing in the trunk. Dang it. Okay, what about this crate? Ugh, no, everything is rotten. Sick. I don't like this music playing in the background. I feel like something's gonna jump out and scare me. And that is the last thing I want happening right now. Like, I... I get jump scared enough playing my other series. I don't need to be jump scared here. This is like a safe space for me. <laughs> I'm not playing Baldur's Gate 3 to get scared. I'm playing Baldur's Gate 3 to have fun. Believe me, I'm having fun, but these sounds in the background is just making me on a high alert right now. Like, I'm looking at every corner. What is around every corner? I am just paranoid at this point. I don't even know if I want to go over there. I saw something dead over there. I don't think I want to go over there just yet. Ooh. Oh, I see. I see the last light in over there. Okay, there's nothing over here. I guess we're going over near the dead thing. Like, why? Why are all these sounds happening? Oh, it wasn't a dead thing. It was a bush. It's it's just a... It's a bush that's dead. I mean, technically it is a dead thing, but... It's not what I thought I saw. There's also a dead body here. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna read what this letter says here. It says, I'm... A... God's damned... Genius. I don't think you're really a God's damned genius when you're dead, but I mean... What do I know? I'm not a genius. Who am I to say this guy ain't a genius? I'm gonna keep reading. This curse has people legging it. A couple of idiots begged me to run back and grab their stuff. But the ring, the ring is my ticket to the city. The old man was desperate. You should have heard the sob story. 
Ellie May was his wife, love of his life, blah, blah. He used to camp by her grave. Kind of weird, if you ask me. Anyway, she was buried with his family ring. It's deeper into the darkness. I'll grab it and be on my way to you. Baldur's Gate better prepare itself. Cause with the two of us in the city, we'll wring every last copper out of the place. Love you, Dandelion. See you soon. Oh, poor Dandelion's never gonna get this letter. I'll just take his stuff over here. Thank you. Oh, look at that. Another dead animal over there. Um, probably best not to poke it. The animal never had a chance. Ugh. The curse consumes everything it touches. Damn. Yeah, this is definitely a place I'm gonna easily get lost in. Um, this place is dark and scary here. I'm just gonna light up everything that I've been by. So, if I make a circle and I see a light, I'll be like, look, I've been here. I'm going in circles. And if I magically get lost, all I need to do is look for the light and follow my way back home. You see, you're learning survival skills by watching my gameplay. Y you didn't think you would learn that today, did you? And if you already knew that, congratulations. Shut up. And don't ruin my moment here. Just lie and say, wow, I learned something new today. Thanks, Swami. There was nothing over here. You know, I thought Act 2 had a lot of hidden stuff. Apparently not here. Not here, because I've, I've yet to find it. This map is also really fucking large, so I've just barely scratched the surface. So I probably just need to keep wandering around. Oh. What is this? Just light this up here. There we go. Survival Skills 101 with Swami. Just light up everything. Oh, we found a door, y'all. What does this door lead us to? Entrance to the Underdark. What? Oh, that was the other entrance you can get into the Shadow Curse Lands. Gotcha. Gotcha. We, we came from above, from Mountain Pass, and we went down. I guess we skipped all of the Underdark stuff. So, that's my bad. I didn't go the typical route everybody else goes to. I did a shortcut. Um, I'm gonna just tell y'all right off the bat I don't go to the Underdark I completely skipped it I thought you know if I get done with the Shadow Curse stuff I could go backwards um without spoiling anything I can't go backwards after I'm done with this place you cannot go backwards I've I've tried so I've learned my lesson there, so my next playthrough that I do, I I will make sure I go through everything. I mean, if y'all want me to do another playthrough, I'm completely fine with that. Oh, we all failed that one. We are not perceptive at all in this place. Usually, one person makes the saving throw. None of us did that time, so I don't know what that means. I'm scared. I feel like I'm about to get attacked. But no, I'm not perceptive at all. What am I talking about, right? <laughs> hmm. Maybe I was overthinking it. Oh, oh! Never mind! I knew it! I knew it! But my dumbass character was surprised. In fact, everybody in my party was surprised by this. Don't know how. I don't know how we were all surprised. Like, this wasn't a good ambush spot, but... Okay. <laughs> Great, we all had to skip a turn. What? What the fuck? fuck was that? What were you just trying to do? Were you trying to constrict Tav here? Uh-uh. Stop. Stop picking on me. Stop it. We're not doing this, y'all. Okay. Okay. We finally got over us being shocked. <laughs> and now it's our turn. Ooh. Soul breaker. I've been waiting to try this one out. Okay. Come on. We got a disadvantage. I don't care. That was on a disadvantage? Imagine if that was on an advantage. We would have gotten more damage. Damn. Damn. Yeah, finish him, Lancel. He's on one hit point. Finish him. Action surge. Let's go. Boom. Bye-bye. I was just about to say ascend, Lancel, but we don't want to ascend. No, we ain't ascending for Velaketh. Menacing attack. Let's go. Let's go, Lancel. Go off. Don't sleep on Lazelle. You can make her into a tank as well. And that's exactly what I've done here. Made her into a tank. Boom! 
Well done, Lazel. That was a beautiful turn. Beautiful. Where do I go from here? All right, Tab, you're up, buddy. All right, burning hands. Let's do it. Ooh, oh, that was that was good, Tab. I guess he picked up a few things from Carlac there. La da da. Speaking of Carlac, I'm inspiring you. Go get him, girl. Hey, this song's all right, but I'm playing my own tune. Oh, that's cute. Y'all really thought throwing needles at Shadowheart in the darkness is going to affect her in any way. No, she embraces this. Go get him, Carlac. Nice. Oh, so it explodes when they die. Got it. Okay, cool, cool, cool. All right. Boom! Oh, Carlac actually took some hit points there. You know, it's been a while since I've seen her take damage. She's usually a sponge. Hey, y'all ruined my song for one full turn. Can I just play my song? That's all I'm asking. Every time I try to do a perform stuff, it's like, nope, shut up. <laughs> they hit me every time. I'm not a bad musician. In fact, I think I'm, I'm pretty good. We're trying this out. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh! Oh my gosh, that actually worked out because she. Not only did she kill him, but she, it. The intensity pushed him back, so it saved her for having to do a saving throw. That. Well done, Shadowheart. Oh, shit. Come on, Lazel. Come on, Lazel. You had such a good round. There you go. Oh. We all good? We can all level up now. Okay, let's rest up first. Oh, you're welcome. It's time to level up. God damn, do y'all see the hit points Lazelle and Carlyke has? Fucking tanks. They ain't gonna carry me and Shadowheart. I, I have the least amount of hit points out of everybody in this group here. Oh, locked you say? Oh, Shadowheart. Oh, Jesus. Okay, hold on, let me help you. I got you. You're welcome. Okay. Let me just um lock pick this here. Don't mind me. Come on. Oh. Is that enough? God damn it. Why do I always try to lock pick things? This is like the one thing I can't do. Okay, let me try this again. I have a feeling. I need guidance this time. Oh, I didn't need guidance that time. I rolled high. I got 24. There we go. What's in this chest? Ooh. And a ring and a I'll take the finger. Why not? Like I'd rather take the giant finger than a copper band. Copper doesn't mean anything in this game. I became so bougie for no reason. Like I said, I don't like the sounds this place makes. It doesn't feel safe. Like, what twigs is moving around? Is there something lurking in the shadows? Is, is something going to come out and get us? Oh, there's... I see a bird over there. Before I go over there, let me... Let me just, um... Oh, I had the key for this one. Okay, cool. Um, yeah, sure, I'll take everything. Why not? Okay, let's go talk to that bird over there. Okay, I have to go completely all the way back around because there was no direct shot to go to wherever that bird was. So I have to go all the way back here. Um. Huh. Someone here? Huh. Oh. Ellie May. <gasps> You've seen this name before. I have, narrator. Ellie May. My light, my hope, my joy. There's a ring over here. Am I, am I right? Was, was that what the note said? It said that... Oh, it's somewhere. Okay. Well, I found where Ellie May is. Something oh. Over there. Time to dig. Let's see what's in here. Ooh, yes, we like that. Gold and silver, yes. Copper and bronze, get that out of my face. Sorry, got distracted here. We eventually made it all the way back around and found the bird. Oh, look, there's a person near it. What? Is, 
What are y'all doing? Where lies your guilt? The waning moon. Oh, sorry. Am I interrupting anything? I just saw your bird and I thought, oh, wow, a bird. You know, not many people out here in the darkness. What are you doing out here? I am not people. Oh. Though many would question how wise it is to approach a stranger in the dark. Well, I mean, yeah, if I was by myself. Be on your way. Well, hang on. I wanted to talk to the bird. Oh. <laughs> Damn it! My speak to animals is not on. A fair point. What? Perhaps this one could assist us. Can you translate? My translation's not working. The murdered lie silent. The raven asks, will you be their voice? Hmm. Depends. Who murdered this woman? Why are you interrogating her? She is not the victim. But she's dead. Nay, she is the perpetrator. Perpetrating who? She's dead. This woman tended a bar where she took her patrons, her friends, into her confidence. Promised their secrets were safe with her. Yet she turned their words into knives and stabbed them in the back. They died because of her. And to this day, her victims lie unavenged. I think they're pretty avenged. She's dead. How much more can she pay? You want her to suffer in the afterlife? Is that... is death not enough? Death is not the end. Merely another beginning. Okay. I seek a record of this one's crimes, written in her own hand. Through it, I can summon her spirit and force her to face trial for her crime. I'm sorry, but she she's dead. What more could you possibly do? Why would you want to do that? My reasons are of no consequence. Your soul sparks with justice, with fortitude. This is your chance to bring a murderer to justice, to avenge her victims. Will you take it? I mean, if you want me to be a juror, sure. Just, just as long as I get paid. I, I don't care. You may not like my ruling. The death of heroism is close, I see. Go to the distillery, the one she calls the Waning Moon. Find the ledger and bring it to me. Okay, so let me let me get this straight here. You want me to go find evidence and not question her? Oh, okay. Look, I'm not. I'm not trying to play jury today. We'll, we'll deal with this later. What else is around here? At this point, I'm just wandering around in the shadows, just um, exploring. Just seeing if there's anything I can do before I start. Well, why did we all fail again? What is over here? The last time we all failed, we all got surprised and got ambushed. What is over here? I don't I don't like the fact that we all fail something. Yeah, there's definitely something over here. We're about to get ambushed. I don't care. I don't I'm not gonna get surprised like last time. I'm ready. There's gotta be something over here. You know what? Let's uh... Holy shit, what is that? How do y'all all not see that? I'm sorry. How do y'all all not see that that's there? Just how? 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 How are you about to get surprised by that thing? Okay. Let's just walk up to it. Oh look, we're all surprised! Oh my god! <laughs> Well, everyone except Lazel, I actually put one of her perks to not get surprised. So, at least someone is a spooked. Menacing attack because it's menacing! Ah! Oh. Okay, well, you know what? We're gonna, we gonna lacerate. Yeah! There we go. There you go. Keep going, Lazel. Keep going. Let's, let's pummel strike this bitch. Boom! Oh, I thought it would do a bit more damage, but we're fine. We're fine. Um, you cannot whip Blazel. I don't know how many times we have to teach all this. You can throw needles. That That's fine. You just can't whip her. I thought we've talked about this. 
Oh, I've been constricted. Oh, no, they got me. Ow. Ow. <laughs> Why was that two critical hits? Why did I take two critical hits for that? No. Oh, my God. They're going to kill me. I'm going to die again. What is it with this Shadow Curse land? It's like, I have been in three total battles so far in this Shadow Curse lands. And the first one, I was downed. <laughs> And I have a feeling I'm about to get downed again. Come on, Lacell. Just just keep going, girl. Y'all gonna have to carry me. Oh, don't don't miss Lacell. We we need you. We need you. Keep going. Just keep going. Action surge. You got this. Just do a normal attack. Yeah, do a normal one. Critical! Let's go! Oh my god. Oh my god. Lacell is down. I repeat, Lacell is down. She did take down a lot of people with that critical hit, but it also took her down as well. We, we need to go in there and save her. But Carlock's gonna go in and try to save Tab right now with a smite! Jesus. Wait, why did they not explode? Huh. Okay, well. Hey oh, we missed critically. Okay, that's fine. Still breathing, despite everything. You have two hit points left, Tav. What do you want to do? You want to heal yourself up thinking you can you can do it? Or do you want to try to go over there and save Lazelle? It's up to you. Um. Let's, um. Hmm. Okay, I. This is what we'll do. We'll have Shadowheart go in and save Lazelle. Heal yourself up, Tav. There you go. Too much to bear. You, you're fine. You are fine. You're near Harlack. It's going to be fine. Do something. Let's go! Critical hit! Oh, we can do it again. Do it again. Do it again. Oh, we critically missed. Good God. The plan is for you to go in there and save Lazelle, if you can. Please. Pretty please. Okay. We're just putting Sanctuary on tab here. That, that's fine. Go save Lazelle. Can't afford casualties now. Let's go. Come on. Take two. Take two. Here you go. Oh, 18. That's not bad at all. Good job, Cleric. Hey, Lizelle, how you doing? You got any health potions on you? No. You don't care. Okay. That's fine. Menacing attack because it's menacing! Lizelle is down again. I repeat, Lizelle is down again. I don't know if I should commend her for her bravery or for her stupidity right now. She's doing her best. That's that's just what I'm saying. Just help her up, Carlac. Ah, there we go. All right, we got a fucking rage, Carlac. That's my favorite one. Lazelle, how you doing? Get your second wind in, please. Be gone, Death. You will not take me. I don't know why I have to voice everybody. Everybody's on mute right now. I'm not gonna lie, I'm having to add in sound effects. Here, I, I don't know why everyone's on mute. Oh yeah, that's right, we're in Sanctuary. We aren't gonna get hurt. You focus on yourself, Tav. You just don't die. Oh, so you do speak. Just when it's convenient for you. Okay. Okay, let me heal Flazel. You need this, girl. Come here. Ah, you must feel so much better now. Got to keep fighting. Oh, so y'all do speak. Okay, that's that's fine. Let's do this. Ooh. Oh, they killing it with the music right now. Good try, Shadowheart. Good try. Let's heal up Lazel. Take two! At least she's not on the verge of death anymore. Oh! Oh, no! God! I thought we lost Shadowheart just now. I, oh, my God. That went from zero to a hundred real quick. Wait, let me talk to you about it. Come here. I can't do that to Shadowheart. Yeah, I'm done with the Sanctuary. It's time to pay your attention to me. Come on, buddy. I, I know you want it. Take your anger out on the bard. I know. I, I hurt your feelings. Let me just take this potion here real quick. I already know it's coming. A misty step. A misty step. We go, misty step. We go, misty step. And now I'm about to hit you. Now I'm menacing. That's right. Yeah, that's right. Oh, I ain't done. I ain't done. I'm just deciding what I want to do with you. We'll do sweeping attack. Let's go. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. I did that to you. What's up? I'm going after you, buddy. You ain't doing this, Shadowheart, and getting away with it. Let's go. Come on. Come on, Carlac. 
Just boom. One more time. One more time. I love how you get three attacks. Boom. That's right. That's right. Ooh. Damn it. I should have helped her. Okay. That, that's fine. She ain't going anywhere. Oh my god. Stop. Not going to last much longer. Oh, Shadowheart. We about to lose Shadowheart and Lizelle and Taff if we get lucky here. Carla, <laughs> I hope you're ready. You, we gonna need you now more than ever. Oh my god. Oh my god, Lizelle. Is it because of all the concussions that you received? Is that it? Oh, he had one more hit point left. Okay. Um, push him. Why not? Let's go! <laughs> Fuck you! Okay, help her out. Help her out. If needed, we'll just lift you over Carlac's shoulder and carry you to safety. I know that's what you want, Shadowheart. I heard you say that. Oh, so much for peace. Well, Taff, how about you get in there and and do something? I am the backup cleric. I need to do my job here. I got you. You're gonna have to do some praying, cause that's all I got. Come on, come on. You gonna pass without a trace? Let's do it. Ooh. Does that apply for all of us? But how does that provoke? Okay. It can't be. Oh, you just gonna pass? Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm I knew it was coming. What the fuck? Why did you throw up on me? <laughs> come on! Oh, it's all right, Carla. Come on, just just kill him. Kill him now, please. He does not just get to throw up on me with that and get away with it. Come on, Carlac! Oh, it's down to one. Okay, okay, come on, Lazel. You've done this the whole fight. You don't care. Just charge in there and kill him. Lazel, I swear to God, clutch up, please. Thank you. Thank you. Dramatic for what, sir? Shadowheart! Oh, God. Shadowheart, I'm here to help. Are you alright? Don't ask why I'm covered in goo. Just don't, don't ask. Carlac, I know you're feeling amazing right now and you're like, I could go again, but we are about to die over here. We're going back to camp and we're gonna take a long rest. We, we need it. Um, is this new? Yeah, this place is new. I don't think I've been here before. Huh. I don't know where anyone's at. Hi, Barbie. Oh, I am so sorry. I didn't mean to take your, no, no! We took her bear. Oh my god. What's on your mind? Carlac, like, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to take Clive. I, I just, I was trying to talk to you. Can I, can I make it up to you? Go on. I will give you back Clive after I kiss you. How about, how about that? Can I, can I kiss you? Hold on. Before, before I kiss you. Are you happy with how things are going between us? If you're happy, I'm happy. Okay. Are you happy? Girl, I am so happy. I'm delirious. Couldn't have said it better myself. So, uh, can I kiss you now? I was hoping you'd say that. <laughs> Come here. Oh, what are you looking at? Oh, oh, my face. Yeah, it, I'm okay. It hurts for a little bit, but it'll go away tomorrow. Aww. Y'all are too cute. I love how sweet she's being right now. Oh, stop. It's like y'all are made for each other. Oh my god. Oh, my heart. <laughs> you are absolutely adorable. Thank you. No, no. Thank you. I picked up some clothes earlier. Let me, let me just see how they look on me here. Ah! Oh! Nope. Switch it back. Switch it back, Taff. You look like a poor peasant here. <laughs> and those are way too short. Yeah, we don't have the legs to be wearing them hoochie daddy shorts. I'm, I'm sorry, Tav. It's just not for everybody. Shah's blessings upon you. Okay, good. You're still alive. That's good. That's good. You're at one hit point. I'm, I'm gonna be checking hourly for you. Need something? Interesting. You don't need to talk to me. The one night I'm not trying to get laid here. How convenient. Halzen, why are you isolating yourself all the way out here, man? You need to join the group. You wish to speak? Yeah! You know, there's a flaming fist at last light and blah blah blah. He spoke about Daniel. He is? Mm-hmm. Then I must see him. Insensible or not, he knows something. I will go to see him at once. Join me when you can. Oh, uh, okay. And just like that, he's just walking out of here. Huh. Okay, well, um, does that mean you're leaving us or, or what? I don't want you to leave, man. Where are you going? 
You just gonna walk over there. Do you even know where you're at? I don't know where I'm at. Where do you- He must know where he's at. He's just walking off into the distance. Okay, bye. I guess I'll see you later. I guess he doesn't want dinner here. I'm just gonna have dinner and go to bed. Oh, Halson's missing out. We're having a whole feast over here. Is that me, snore tab? Roll over. Roll the fuck over. We're not snores. Okay. 